Business is the foundation, it's the lifeblood of the community, it's what brings money into the community, that they're the um, people in the community that circulate uh, and create wealth in the community and without businesses. Um, people don't have jobs, they don't have the services and the goods that they need uh, in their daily lives. So for us, business creates community. Hi, I'm Tassel. Welcome to Belva. We've been waiting for you. Exciting times for our municipality. You know, we've got a lot of moving parts going on, and uh, you know, we have a lot of good discussion, good debate, and you know, we have some really good uh, positive resolutions. I've always enjoyed uh, this uh, this area, and uh, so we've uh, elected to stay here and expand the business here. Uh, you know, we've had uh, good access to uh, uh, workers, uh, sores, and that from uh, that that has been an industry familiar to Belleville in the past. So uh, that's where. That's why we got started here and that's why we continue to be here. Thankfully, you know, we're in a community that we're in. It's growing, it's thriving, it's exciting. I'm really excited about what's happening in the whole Bay of Quinney region, trying to bring more business and more people to the area. And there's all kinds of great reasons for people to come here. A lot of folks who don't know Belleville or haven't taken the time to visit Belleville have no idea what we have to offer here. When they see the kind of housing that we've got, the kind of commercial development that we have, when they take a look at their waterfront, they are literally blown away by what this community has to offer. And then when we start talking affordability, when you look at our average home prices, when you look at our available labor rates, um, it's a really easy business case to make when you combine it with the quality of life that we have to offer. One of the things that I think as a company we're most proud of is we don't have a lot of staff turnover. We have employees here who have worked here 20, 25 years. We're really proud of that and I think that speaks to the work ethic of people from this region, um, whether it be just a hard working nature or the education that they get. We have a lot of employees now that are graduates of Loyalist College and we can't say enough about the HR and the business administration courses that we've hired people out of and uh, we've really benefited from it. There are a lot of very successful entrepreneurs in this community that are very willing to help, to share, to lend a hand, to give advice. Um, we do business with each other. We do community work for each other, which is, or, or with each other, and that's how you really get to know know people, not necessarily in their business, but you get to know people as people. We're really excited that we did choose to come to Belleville and it's done very well. And Panera is, uh, generally tries to go into areas where there's a strong sense of community and just to add value. That's what they're looking for. Do. I, I would call us very resilient, uh, you know, I, I've seen bad times for Belleville. This community, in my opinion, seems to bounce back. We seem to handle those kind of things pretty well. I think there's a resilience to Belleville that I don't see everywhere else. The city's actually been very proactive in um, making Belleville the best place for business to invest. We should set the level of, of confidence to the business community and we should let them know that we are going to invest in the future of our community so they invest in the future of our people. Belleville Council and City Hall understands the importance of business uh, in the community. Without the support of business, none of the things we love about Belleville are possible. Small business is essential to, to the success, to the strength, uh, the real core strength of a local economy. We have our large businesses, we all know those, we have the large manufacturers, we have a lot of the, uh, the retail chains if you will, you know, restaurant chains and stuff, and that's good. Uh, they provide a huge economic impact to the city, but the real core of it is the small, independent, locally owned business. That's where a lot of the, um, the vibrancy comes from, that's where the local, a lot of the local flavor comes from. That's where a lot of the employment comes from. So it's, it's critically important. 
Belvo really is one of the best kept secrets in the province. Uh, people who aren't familiar with us uh, are always surprised when we have the opportunity to show them around the community, to talk about all the advantages that are here, to talk about the businesses that are here. Uh, they're always surprised at the level and the caliber of services that Belleville has to offer. Well, it's been a fantastic year uh, and I'm humbled uh, to be the cheerleader for the City of Belleville for the first year, 2015. And uh, we, you know, we've had so many great uh, projects that have, have come forward and we've successfully completed and uh, we have a lot of more projects going forward.